I wanted to come to South Africa to hunt. My husband, uh, he's been on a couple of trips here. Uh, he talks about it non-stop, just had an amazing time and he wanted to, to bring me for a vacation of a lifetime and uh, a hunt of a lifetime. And it was, it truly was, uh, I loved it all. I wanted to hunt a lioness because I think they're beautiful creatures and so I really wanted to, to go on the hunt and try the dangerous game. This, this is my first dangerous game hunt and it was truly spectacular. Professional hunters with us, they really know what they're doing and guided me through everything and it was truly amazing, amazing hunt. that we pick up some fresh tracks near the water hole. They drank some water and it's windy here. So yeah, let's take those tracks and see okay. if we can find them. Okay, so, so yeah. good. let's okay. do it. Let's see. The tracker took us to the where the track started and then we started following the track along. And um, at times it was actually really hard to pick up her, her track. She was very smart, like zigzagging around, crossing back and forth in this uh, area. She's not gonna go far anymore. She's starting to get fed up now. So yeah. Stay close. Doing this big stuff now. Stay close to me. She actually stopped at one point after about, I think it was about two and a half hours of hiking. She actually stopped in the grass and you could see her face. She was sitting there watching, watching us walk in. So at that moment, the tracker set up the, the shooting stick for me and uh, I prepared my rifle for, to try to get a shot. I couldn't see her body. I couldn't see which way her body was turned. So uh, we actually picked up the stick and we, and we started stalking around and trying to get a little bit closer onto the side of her so we could see the side of her and see her, so I could see her body. At that moment, she was sitting uh, quite calmly and just watching us, but she was just a little bit too low down in the grass, and uh, I didn't want to take a chance on, uh, on a poor shot. We took the sticks away and then she, she proceeded on at uh, still a fairly quick pace, but we, we kept up with her quick. Um, and now she was getting tired, so we really had to put pressure on her and uh, keep her moving so that uh, she'd tire out. So then we started pushing her really hard and eventually she bedded down under a tree and she was watching us. Here. Mm -hmm. Jack, Jack, come, come. Right here, the tree. You see it? Just to the left of its head. Okay, you ready? Reload, 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 reload. Hang on.
pick up your rifle. Fifty one. Yeah. Let's go closer. Stay here. The shot was good. Everything just went perfectly. She rolled over and it was a successful hunt. Let's go and check her. Come around. Okay. Check her. Say. Well done. Good shooting. Thank you. Same here. Awesome. Thank you. Yeah, it was quite a difficult hunt. We walked for around about six hours. And luckily, when it starts getting warmer, we bumped her. Yeah, this was an amazing, life-changing experience. It's been, it's been an incredible, incredible day. Yeah, yeah, I loved it. It was awesome. My, my heart was pounding hard <laughs> in my chest, but you, you just kept things calm and, and kept things on trap. So yeah, it was awesome. Well done on a great trophy. Thank you, yes, and, I, and I appreciate your, your help. You yes, did a great job for me. Thank you. Yes, Thank you. Yeah.